Hey you guys, it's your Marty Geek. In this video, I want to share with you guys a little tip video on how to transfer files between iOS and Android devices. Uh, like you guys know, on iOS, it's a little bit hard to transfer files or receive files via Bluetooth, wireless, or NFC. Um, but you know, with this app that I have found here, it's called Send Anywhere. And believe me, guys, this, this is not the only app available in the Play Store or App Store that actually do this feature. But this is one of them that I really, really like. So this is the one I'm sharing with you guys. Um, it's called Send Anywhere. And what it does is that it lets you transfer files. It doesn't matter the size of the file to any platform. It could be iOS. It could be your PC, your Mac and versa versa as well from ios you could transfer here as well and i'm going to show you guys how easy it is the first thing that you do is install the app of course then you're going to create a name where uh, for example if you're going to transfer a file to somebody uh somebody can see your name so i put mark the geek right there so that's it that's the only thing you do you do not create an account like your login and password you do not do that which is awesome and here you got the send and receive button so and here you see the recent devices these are devices that i've been sharing with i got the macbook and i got the ipad and share file for 24 hours um this right here you can share files um via the internet and then they those files are available for 24 hours and all you got to do is like share with your friends um a specific code and then with that code they can download those files but they expire like in within 24 hours that's pretty cool uh right now we're gonna go ahead and send the file here so we can have an as an example um here we got photos audio videos you got contacts you got apps you got files and folders um, here I'm going to go ahead and transfer a video. Um, I'm going to go ahead and transfer a small one right here just for the purpose of this video. But like you see here, you could transfer more than one um, video at the time. Here I could go ahead and press next and I'll transfer that. But for the purpose of this video, I'm just going to go ahead and send this one right there. Uh, go ahead and select next. It's going to create a code. Um, and this code, you're going to enter it over here. When you click here, receive, you're going to enter the code right there. But another cool feature is that you can create a QR code. You could go ahead and click here, QR code, and it's ready to, for you to put the phone here in the camera. Look at that, how fast that was. That was insanely fast. And now it's going to go ahead and start the transfer between your android device and ios and like i said it works the other way around too you can send files from your ios to your android device as well and let's go ahead and wait for this to finish so like you see right there the video file started it takes a couple seconds before it starts uh, transferring uh this file is not that big uh but um it's a very cool app for um instances that where you are on the go and for example if you have an ipad or any other tablet and you want to like uh, create a video uh, you can actually do that the great thing of transferring files between the um, android to ios is that the video or photos they go directly to your gallery and from there you can access for example if you use imovie or another video editing app on your on your ipad you can actually access those files and add them to your project or create a project with those videos. So this is good for, for example, right here I'm using gameplay video footage that I recorded on the phone and transferring over here. So right now it's about to finish. Look at that, pretty fast. Remember, you have to be on Wi-Fi, of course. And uh, that's it, done video here is done uh we can see the video file right there if you want like you see there this is the video that we just transferred right now <laughs> very very cool uh click done uh for example i want to show you guys that it's actually here available in gallery uh here in photos look at it it's right there and of course if you want if you're like me that use imovie and edit video you could create a project, new movie. Okay, let's go and select this one. Whoops. <laughs> create. Um, here I can access the re recently added right there. And look at that. I could go ahead and, and do start my project right there. So this is an awesome, awesome 
app that lets you do that. And like I said, uh, this is not the only app that actually does that between these uh, transferring file between devices. Uh, same thing goes this way around. If you want to send the file from your iPad, right? Yep. Um, let's say I want to send the file from here, a video. Uh, let's go to this right here, this video right there. Send it. It's going to send over here. You go over here, you're going to click receive. Uh, QR code. Let's go ahead and QR code, which is the easiest one. Uh, here, I'm going to... Okay. Got it. And there it is. Uh, remind me, remind me later. And I guess that's it. Wow, that, that can't be. That was so fast. Here, let's click OK. Let's go ahead and be the video. Look at that. That was very, very fast. And of course, that was a short video that I recorded with my iPad testing the slow motion feature. You see that? That was very super fast. Um, and now let me go ahead and show you guys how it works um, transferring files to your PC. Okay, so now let's go ahead and show you guys how it works transferring files to your PC or Mac. Here I'm testing it on the Mac, but it functions the same way. It doesn't matter which platform you use. Um, here on the website, if we go to the website, send anywhere, uh, you can see some instructions on how to do it. Like you see here, it says uh, transfer any file styles as many uh, times as you want for free uh, quick given your network conditions and file blah blah blah, blah. Um, easy uh, this is one of the best thing that you just enter six codes and across any type of uh, file and full platform no sign up or login required uh, so the first thing you're going to do here of course is click the download section uh, right here if you have a pc or download to pc if you have a mac right here just go ahead and download the Mac and it'll take you right here to the store which you are gonna uh, um, install of course but if you want to skip all that just go to the to the app store on your MacBook and just download it right there uh, then after that let's go ahead here and show you guys how cool the app looks looks very very nice there um, on the Mac uh, you got send you got receive uh, right here let's go ahead and send another file here for example, send another video. Let's go and send this one, which is a little bit bigger. You know what? Let's go ahead and send uh, two files. Let's go ahead and send these two, uh, these two files. Uh, let's go ahead and click next. Uh, now you have the code. Um, here I'm gonna go ahead and receive. Uh, right here, like you see, there's no option for QR code. So I guess we're gonna have to enter the code here, which is four six two space nine three three, and click okay just like that and put key and look at that just like that the video is starting to download here on your mac um you can see the time remaining you can see that it says uh receiving two files and this thing is going very fast um over here you can see a history of all the files that you have um transferred so far since you're using this app um and of course it's free on your mobile phones it's free on your pcs or macs and there it goes it finished finish over here and finish over here uh, now we could go ahead here to the open folder and there it is here are the videos that i just transferred you see there very 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 cool and that's it guys um thanks for watching the video just wanted to share this video with you guys just in case you're wondering how can i transfer files from ios uh to android or from the android to ios if you think sometimes some people think it's impossible because it's different platforms and yes back then it used to be very very hard but nowadays it's very easy because this is not the only app that does that uh, but this is one of the apps that i really really like and i'm here sharing it with you guys so i hope you guys like it I'm, i'll leave a link in my description for the windows um for the Android app and for the website here for um, Send Anywhere. Thanks for watching the video, guys. Till next time.